Welcome to Simple Software Tutorials. In this video, I'm going to show you two easy ways to separate names in Excel. Now, this works best if you have names with just one first name and one last name. If you have uh, people on this list that have, you know, two last names that aren't hyphenated, um, it may be a little more difficult, but you can still manually fix it, and this is probably still going to be a very good solution for you. So the first method I'm going to show you is the flash fill method. So the way we do this is I have all my names listed in column A here. So then what I'm going to do is go into column B and type in the first name. And then in C, I'm going to type in the last name. Now I'm going to click under this first name here. And then I'm going to click on data and then flash fill. And that's going to automatically guess what I'm doing and automatically fill it in there. And then I can do the same thing for the last name. And this can also be done, the shortcut is control E. So that's one really very simple way to do this. Now, the second way is using text to columns. So I'm going to copy this list and stick it over here. Now with text to columns, um, you want to make sure you have a couple free columns to the right because when you split these apart, it's going to automatically fill in these col columns. So if you have uh, content in there, it could overwrite it. So just make sure you've got a couple extra columns there. So same thing, we're going to highlight this whole column here. And then again, on the data tab, we're going to click on text to columns. Now there's a couple options here and we want to use delimited because that way we're using a certain character uh, that's going to separate these and that character is a space. So I'm going to click on next and then Typically it has tab selected, um, but we want to uncheck that and just make sure that only space is selected unless you're using some other something other than the space, then you can select it here or enter it manually in here. And a great thing is it gives a preview down below showing exactly how it's going to split up your, your data there. And then we can click on finish and there you go you have it split up. So that's two pretty simple ways to split up names in Excel. So I hope this video was helpful to you. Don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel for more helpful videos. Leave me a comment or a like if this was helpful or if you have questions or ideas. You guys come up with fantastic ideas for me. I, I, I appreciate it and have a great day. Thanks so much for tuning in.